天野勲と申します野号は小倉の天寿司ですね How far are you willing to travel for good sushi? Some of you might get in your car and drive an hour to another city. As for us, we left Tokyo, flew two hours to Fukuoka, got on a train, and came to the port city of Kokura. Tonight, we are dining at Tenzushi, who many hardcore foodies of Japan regard as one of, some even say he is the god of sushi. Come, let me show you what this is all about. アマノイサオと申します。野号は小倉の天寿司ですね。創業は昭和14年からなので78年になります。寿司屋になったのは42年ですね。九州のお魚でおもてなしをしたいという気持ちは常にあります。その江戸前じゃない。召し上がり方を九州の田舎では提供したいっていう親父が考えてだから江戸前で焼きはダメですよじゃあ九州では炙って差し上げましょう江戸前とうちのお寿司の違いっていうのは江戸前は引き算です引いて引いてシンプルに作り上げていきますでもうちの場合は足して足してもっと楽しんで味わっていただけるもっとそのいか本来の味よりももっと美味しいものを追求していったことが今の形になってきててで九州に来られた時にいや九州来てよかったなと思えるようなお寿司ができればいいかなって思ってるんですよねだから東京に東京で食べられない召し上がり方をうちでは提供していきたいと思ってます<音楽>うちに来られる時はまずのれんをくぐってまたのれんをくぐって出られるまで。一つの空間として美味しいものを提供するのは当然のことなのでその美味しさに私は握りの中に天寿司の心を入れていますその心っていうのは結局私の感性になるんですけども各お店の店主の感性が込めたものをお出しするからこそそのお店の味が出てくると思いますですからその心のこもったお寿司を食べていただいて帰られる時には嫌なことあっても何があってもなんか良かったなって思えるようなお寿司を作っていきたいと思ってます。An amazing way to start the meal. First piece in. I've been waiting for this. We've been planning this shoot for so long.、Mm. It's such a bold statement to start off with Toro. That's usually what people end their service off with. But to begin with a delicious piece of Toro like that, you know you're in for a ride. やっぱりトロは寿司屋の花かなと思いますし最初にそのトロを食べていただくことによって一つの流れが出来上がっていくので九州にはとてもいい白身の魚青魚いろいろ盛り上がりに持ってこれるお魚がたくさんあるのでまずはトロを食べていただいてそれから握る構成を考えていきたいと思って最初にトロを握ってます。Mm. There are so many flavors happening right now in my mouth.、Mm. The squid is really sweet and super soft, but then you get this like bright citrus flavor, and then suddenly 
there's some creaminess in there and you realize that there's uni hiding in there. And then there's little crunchy popping bubbles in your mouth of the fish eggs. And then there's like kind of sesame seed flavor with it as well, kind of nutty. It's like an entire dinner plate being served to you with all these little dishes that's been compacted into one piece of sushi. Wow. イカはイカの美味しさを江戸前のお寿司で十分堪能されてると思います。ですからうちではそのイカをもっと違う美味しさでイカの味をもっと上げてあげようと思うとプラスの足し算のお寿司になっていったような気がしますね。I don't expect these kind of flavors with sushi regularly. It was so sweet, and at the same time, the citrus made it so bright and refreshing. And it's just such a different flavor profile from what you're used to when you're eating sushi. And it's, we're only three pieces in. I don't know how much more of this I could take. I'm willing to pay the check right now and leave, and I'd be totally satisfied. I'll eat your pieces for you, don't worry. <laughs> okay, I got this. あとのものは全て近海で賄えるものだ。季節によって変わっていきます、それは。大好きなんで、で、この魚屋さんがあるから小倉からは離れられないですね。人と人のつながりじゃないですか。小倉っていうのは天寿司を育ててくれた人たちがいらっしゃるし、私の子供の頃からの思い出がたくさん詰まってる
sweet and spicy at the same time. Not like burning spice, but you feel the tingle of the yuzu pepper. Oh my gosh. Everything about this place is great. Every bite that I have, we have this heavenly music playing. I'm not sure if everyone else could hear it or if it's just in my head. I think I died. This is striped jack. Okay, this is striped jack. It's a very firm fish. So it holds up the powdered soy sauce perfectly. The soy sauce and the ginger manage to like knock each other out rather than having something too salty or too gingery. It almost tastes like Chinese food on a piece of sushi. It's incredible. What's so cool about this is that you taste different parts in different parts of your mouth. So you taste the ginger on one side, and you taste the soy on this side. Two very different flavors with the same fish. You taste the sesame seed in the back. So many experiences just in one mouthful. This is, it's so clever. その繰り返しで42年過ぎました だからあまり扱いが難しいなって思うことはあまりないです。魚がない方が寂しいです。Here we have grilled fugu milt. This is the perfect season for it right now. This is going to be amazing. That's lovely. Mm -hmm. It just explodes into this lovely creaminess that just coats the rice. It's almost like a... The closest comparison of taste I can think of is like an egg yolk. If you bite into like a nice golden egg yolk and it just coats it all. Mm, not a single ounce of fishy taste to it. It's so bizarre because the concept of it is really kind of off-putting for some people. But when you eat it, it's one of the best pieces of the night. That is surprisingly good. Blowfish milt. If you don't know what milt is, look it up. Secret sauce is sweet, matches the eel. There's no bones, there's nothing rough on my tongue. The nori has that little savory kick to it. Oh, Simon. You know what I find amazing? What? I find amazing that uh, Count Dracula enjoys sushi as well because I thought that you only drank the blood of virgins. Oh, uh, uh, uh. Uh, but turns out that. If I'm going to eat some food, it might as well be raw. Ha, ha, ha. This is super original for this place as well because a lot of times you have ginger in between each bite as a palate cleanser. But this here is a cucumber that's been rubbed with salt and it's got a little bit of citrus on top of it. You can dip a little bit of salt there as well. And it's, it's great. I mean, cucumbers are usually just so-so, but this is such a great palate cleanser. Mmm. When you're used to having a specific kind of sushi, and then when you have something like this, it breaks down every conception you have of what sushi should be. This is, this is like a renaissance of sushi. This is like the introduction of James Joyce into the literary canon. This is, this is art. I know that you think that I'm really wanky for saying this, but this is, Food art. It's it's just so good. I just, I'm just so happy. I just love my job. This is so great. <laughs> the final piece of the night, the Tenzushi egg roll. And he told us something wonderful. 
He says it's a bit different than most places because this is inspired by what his mom used to put inside of his bento box. So this is this is gonna be a great piece. Mm. That is great. Sweet. A little bit smoky as well. Custardy, but still you can taste a little bit of firmness there. It's like a dessert, but an egg. Mm. This has been such a wonderful experience. I'm just, I'm so thrilled to be here. I love my life. I love this food. Mm. I don't even want to describe it. I just I want to describe how I feel. I feel moved. I feel inspired. I want to thank, uh, I want to thank all my family and friends that got me here. I want to, th I want to thank the, the Academy for this award. Um, I want to thank my mama. I love you, mama. I love you, mama. Thank, thank you, Japan, for making this kind of food. I don't think you could find anything like this anywhere else in the world. Holy, <laughs> this is amazing. Every店の完成が込めたものをお出しするからこそ、そのお店の味が出てくると思います。ですから。その心のこもったお寿司を食べていただいて帰られる時には嫌なことあっても何があっても何か良かったなって思えるようなお寿司を作っていきたいと思っています。